Today, a bounty of chickpea or garbanzo recipes. Amazing six recipes you're going to love. Eat delicious and lose weight with Chef Pachi. Today, chickpea or garbanzo recipes with some sumac curry, with some red curry paste, with sun-dried tomatoes, walnut paste, with one main ingredient. So our first hummus or dip is a roasted bell pepper hummus. And what we do here is we use Chef Pachi's bell pepper ketchup, yogurt, and the chickpeas. You blend and look at it. Beautiful, that's it. To make Chef Pachi's roasted red pepper ketchup, all you have to do is roast some red peppers in the oven, let them cool, peel them, blend them, and you're done. For our second hummus, we're gonna do our garbanzos, raisins, curry, pinch of salt and pepper, and olive oil. You are going to love it. This is delicious. Actually, it's really even hard to tell that it's garbanzos or chickpeas. And serve them with anything you want, toasts, vegetables, even fruit. Add some ginger. The ginger is the finishing touch of this delicious and amazing hummus or dip. Add it and create an array of nutrients that you won't believe taste so, so good. It's creamy, soft, delicious, with beautiful coloring. Everyone's gonna like it. You can add with different kinds of foods so people pick and choose what to serve them with. Now, we're gonna go to our third hummus or dip. We're gonna add our red curry paste to our chickpeas, some cilantro, and we're gonna add some dark sesame oil. We mix this with some almond milk, which is gonna give it some liquid so we don't add any more oil because we don't want it to be overpowering and we want it to be smooth and perfectly creamy and delicious. Check it out, perfect. We are gonna love this. This is a more Latin flavor and it goes great with all sorts of foods and anything you want to add it to. For our fourth hummus, we're gonna do a Mediterranean style with za'atar, sumac, oregano or cilantro because I didn't have oregano, some almond milk to make it creamy, pinch of salt and pepper, and we're done. We blend to another creamy, beautiful look, a different kind of color, and a beautiful taste. All that brings you back to that Mediterranean with their own flavor and delicious. It actually looks like a chicken liver pate and you can serve it any day. Look at how beautiful it is. For our next dip, we have sun-dried tomatoes with a mix of garam marsala and cumin. This is it. I put half a garam marsala and half cumin in that bag because it goes great with many dishes. Blend it, add a pinch of pepper and salt, and serve it. Also again, like all of the other ones, creamy and delicious. We're gonna put this in beautiful jars that you can actually take if you're going out to visit friends, and you guys can eat them at the same time when you get there. So it could be like a, you know, like something nice to take when you're invited to a friend's house. For our next one, we are gonna add walnut paste. So it's our garbanzos with walnut paste and some almond milk. We're using almond milk to soften some of these so that we don't have to add any more oil. Look at it, beautiful. Again, we're adding it to another container that I'm gonna take out. If I wanna serve them all together, they look beautiful in the same containers or in different ones. And 
we're serving them with some crispy chickpeas that you're gonna love and we're gonna show you how to make them in minutes all of these recipes I made with one pound of dried chickpeas now we're gonna show you how to make the crispy chickpeas they're super easy so we're gonna add a cup of chickpeas over baking pans with a drizzle of olive oil and to one we're gonna add sitar and sumac and the other ones we're only gonna add salt and pepper this is so you also have a different choice of what you add to each one of your crispy chickpeas and it's so simple we're gonna bake them at 425 degrees for 15 minutes open the oven shake them up a little bit so they all become crispy all around and leave them there for another 15 minutes that's it when they come out you're gonna have to keep everyone's hands off them so they don't want to eat them because they are amazing Here they go in and shake them, shake them. They go back in there for 15 minutes and we're done. It's beautiful, it's great, and it can be a whole array of different kinds of flavors and textures with one food only, with a basic food, chickpeas. Let's try our crispy and delicious garbanzos. They are toasted. Mm. Delicious. Listen to it. Take them anywhere as a snack. And add them to any of our toasted rice and flaxseed arepas from Healthy with any of our garbanzo butters. Let's try this one with our smoked bell pepper. Let's add some delicious crispy and toasted garbanzos some of the spicy ones here Ooh, delicious. Mm. Mm. On. chef pachi delicious food amazing enjoy chef pachi